Good evening and welcome to Gray Barn of Andover, New Jersey. Tonight we are going to visit with four of our vendors, Andover Junction, Belmont Farmhouse, Betty's Treasures, and Vintage Crush. In the parentheses, I put their vendor codes as they appear on their tag. All four of those vendors are 20% off items not marked firm, and that is the same for cash or credit. You can reach out to us via Facebook at Gray Barney Antiques or Instagram at Gray Period Barn, and that's gray with the E, or our email at graybarn at graybarnantiques.com. You can find all this as well on our website graybarnantiques.com, always with the E. You can also call us 973-786-5555. We are located in Andover, New Jersey, which is Sussex County up by Newton. Exit 25 off of Route 80. We're about seven or eight minutes up the road. So we do ship the smaller items. If you've not shopped with us before, you can just call, direct message us. Uh, if you're calling us, Please let us know approximately where in the video the item was and which vendor it was so we can pull those items aside for you. Now, first we're gonna visit with Betty's Treasures. She has this built-in bookcase in the corner. You might have, you'll see some of these that you saw on our Thursday night, I believe. I did the tour booth and I went through and showed you all of our vendors. So this is Betty's Treasures. She's the second longest vendor that's been with Gray Barn since it was its original Slackyville across the street at 131. We've now moved to 134, a bigger location. So she has 20% off. These lamps do work. We just don't have them all plugged in. So this really cool tulip ice slipped. That's not too, I guess, it looked like dogwoods in yellow and red. And that is what they call an ice slip. And that one is just $12. So 19, I believe, comes 15, 20. She always has a lot of Little lamps, uh, when she comes back from Florida, I'm sure she will be bringing more stained glass lamps. Uh, like a lot of our vendors, they change out their decor. So you'll see those things come in as they go and shop the other booths and buy stuff and and kind of, you know, it's a cycle, circle of life here. Um, she, she loves her stained glass lamps, so we will see more of those, I'm sure. This is Butterfly Meadow by Lennox, and it's a Laura, I can't quite read that. But it's really beautiful vase. We don't have the box, but it has this bee on it and this attached yellow butterfly, and that's just 1520. We can ship that. So and you'll see it's a mix of contemporary and vintage. A lot more vintage in our shop than contemporary. You might have remembered a few months ago she had this as a set. That set was much older. It was an antique set made in Germany. She's selling these two separately, and these are Japan, and they are $12 each. So the other ones had a little bit more age to them. So it's not easy to find the, the sugar. You can find the pictures, but not always the sugar. And since we are coming up on Easter, you're gonna see a lot of bunnies in the shop. We also have a lot of longer burger, and it prices a lot less than if you had bought them, if you had turned to, attended a longer burger par party and had to buy the liner and the plastic and I bought the ba East, uh, not uh, picnic basket, and that thing, by, by the time all was said and done, it ended up costing me over $100, and I ended up selling it, I think, for $24 eventually. There's a cool yellow cow creamer. I'm not saying, wow. He's just $4.80. He is newer, but he's still very cool, very usable. It is glazed inside, and you'll see a lot of her pink depression glass just came out as well. So, Fastoria coin. She's got amber and green. I think there might be some clear and red in the shop still. I'm not sure. A lot of bunnykins. So I'm going to take you over to... That's a good deal on that, too. Look at this. Just seven twenty. Don just... She's in Florida, so she actually... It's probably a USA pottery. She leaves us her bins, her totes, to uh, put these out while she's away. So Don actually just did that the other day. We were watching another video... Trying to see if there's any. No, that's not. He was showing how when you hold these up to the light, if it picks up uh, orange, then it's an antique one that because they only did. Oh yeah, there's that slate. I have to look at that at a better light. But uh, if it has this orange in it, then it was made a certain way, and it's actually much older. So and that's just eleven twenty for the bunny plate. It also indicated that a lot of times there would have been paint on these, which has since come off. So and that's just eleven twenty for that. So that is. Betty's Treasures, Vendor 16, 
her built-ins and then over here is her shelf in the lock case as you can see there is a black light so you can get that glow going it's not very strong we do have the beast light as i call it and that one really lights up quite well beautiful western germany porcelain fawns for 36. nice spoon seller there for 1440 with the cobalt insert there is some damage to the head vase. You can see the chips on her flower and she is missing an earring. So our vendors, that's just $12, that cute little sheep. Our vendors do try and report any and all flaws that might be on the piece. Fortunately, some of the stuff does happen in the shop, so it might not be noted on the tag right away. Now this is our other vendor. We're visiting with four. This is Vintage Crush. She has a bookcase here, a shelf in this room as well as a booth and a shelf in the Berg, which I'm not gonna go through the Berg shelf because I did do that on the walking tour the other day. So again, if I go past things that you want more prices on, just let me know. She does have the glass fruit all individually priced. So you have the pear is four. I think the larger one's a little bit more, so 640. That's a good deal on this bottle. The tag, the label is as is, but it's still very great issue, uh, age to $1.60. So and that's the other thing with our vendors too. A lot of times they will come through and they will, that's a nice piece of fused glass, they will mark things down if they've been here a bit. So, but you also take that chance that it might not be here when you come in. So we're going to turn around and we're going to go to Belmont Farmhouse. Oh, I'm sorry, I was wrong. She's 30%. See, I said 20%. So at least 20%. So this is actually good news, right? We got an additional 10% vendor going here. So Belmont Farmhouse is actually at 30%. Our other three ladies that I mentioned are indeed 20% off. So she had a whole bunch more stuff over here for St. Patty's Day this Friday. So we near Island. So these little cups are just three fifty. How unusual are these? Very cute. And yes, this little cabinet in here is on sale. So it'd be seventeen fifty. These are parts of a lamp for thirty five. Train carriage sconces. How cool is that? Oh, yeah, they are. Look at that. So this would have been in your Pullmans or whatever that would have been attached. And it looks like somebody used them as candles. I don't think that would have been. But the way the holes in that are, I would think at one point these probably had gas in them. So, again, this is just her bookcase. She does have the booth and a shelf in here as well. This is just an oil stuck in there. Okay, I was like... All right, so that becomes 420, and you have this flower frog. Very cool, little pop for trouble or whatever kind of game that was. And they have lots of baskets of goodies. We have lots of smalls, we have lots of large. So, smalls ship very easily. So, this is Belmont Farmhouse's shelf. She's always got such beautiful glass, and again, she is 30% off. little souvenir hatch it's right from Newton New Jersey beautiful piece of glass there's always lots of great glass in the shop it does not last long it goes out pretty quick and that's a bell back there it is so that funky piece of aqua glass is actually a bell and it's a cranberry bell in the style of my Mary Gregory I don't see any signatures on that that's cranberry glass for 21 on that bell there's always a lot of old books in the shop as well she's recently reduced this 1886 manual of railroads down to 65 and then take that 30 percent off and then we're going to actually go down here to vintage crushes shelf so again we're going to be visiting their booths as well we visited betty's treasures built in so she does not have a booth in the main room while the three vendors that we're visiting within the cases right now belmont farmhouse andover junction and vintage crush all actually have booths in the main room and the and they are 20 percent off and Belmont Farmhouse is the 30% off. That's a nice mosaic pin for $14.40. That's a, a school clarinet. So always beautiful pieces of glass. And then this is Andover Junction. She is the original vendor, and she is 20% off. And again, if I pass by anything too fast and you want more information, please do not hesitate to reach out to us. And it doesn't have to be just from this video, from any of our past videos. We do recommend that you do follow us on Instagram and or Facebook. Wednesday nights at 5.30 is our weekly Facebook Live. 
love to see you on there while it's live. I know when you do watch, I do put up the replay on YouTube, but at that time, you might miss out on some things. Although there's still usually quite a good selection left, but straight ahead is Auntie's Attic. I put her lights on just so it wasn't so dark over here. Then we're gonna go left first, and we're gonna visit with our vendor, Vintage Crush. This is on second thought, and here is the Bronx Man Cave, and here is Vintage Crush, where I did that tour. I did show you that beautiful bird cage. So this is Vintage Crush. And again, 20% off the lower price that you see on there as long as it doesn't say firm. We will be hanging that up for her tomorrow because we do have to get a chain and it's gonna be hanging from up there. It's a shell planter, so these are nice. 24 inch, it does have glass and she does have the measurements. So these are 15 inches. Beautiful needlework for just $24 each on those florals. Gorgeous canvas here, let's see if we can't find a tag. So she does have the measurements, so it's 31 and some change, 16 by 20. There's a very, there's a signature there. Pretty. So I think we'll start over here. And again, all the lighting in her booth is for sale. Um, I think that this cabinet is not. I think the baker's rack is. And I don't think the other shelving is. All the furniture in the center of her booth is. So we've kind of made the mistake of when things did sell the furniture, if you don't have something right away to replace it, then uh-oh, where do you put it? So silver plated trays, always in style. They always make a great statement piece. That one's just $14.40. Blue and white's always hot. That doesn't seem to go out. And like I said, it would be 20% off that lower price. So those become 20 and those are nine inches each. And they're hollow. Be a cup and saucer. Stanford Ware Majelica teapot is seven and a half by nine and a half, so that would be um, 49, it'd be 40, 50, 40, so it'd be 39 and some change. Cute little salt and, uh, salt and pepper corner, just $4. So, Ditch Homer Laughlin Harlequin, uh, $12.80 chip under saucer. So like I said, they do try to get all those issues listed on there. We also have a lot of doilies, and most of the doilies are underneath things they are for sale but you'll also find baskets of them and stuff so we always have a good assortment from many of our vendors in here cute little basket for easter 1955 hull blossom basket for 24. there's a whole stack of franciscan rose bread plates for 24 so that becomes 1920 there's a set of six that's a lot more than six in that stack Maybe she's got two sets of six. There's the older stamp on that. Unusual Perk King pink and gold percolator for 48. So. We always have a lot of Stangle and it's been very, it's been making a comeback again. Stangle is from the Flemington Trenton area. It is a New Jersey pottery. So we do have a lot of people that collect it for that. And then we have people come from out of state, they're visiting and they're always like, this is so pretty and they buy it too and love that it has so much history to it. It's a beautiful chintz blue and white plate for 24. It's a pretty cool set here. It's got bunnies on it. 28 for that platter, that's really cool. Bordello, in Portugal, this is all made. So there's your stamp on that. So that's all this. That's pretty. What is that like dried flowers? It is, and that's 20. I'm not usually, usually you see like one or two dried flowers. This one, they actually did the basket on it. Look at that beautiful frame with the matting on it. Very nice. Some more pink depression, silver crest pie pl uh, cake plate. I'm at 14 minutes already, I've got Three other vendors, no, two other vendors we want to visit with on this side. So again, if I go too fast and you want more information, just let me know. Uh, the Wednesday Night Lives, they're a lot of fun. Oh, here's a, I had somebody looking for all of our Easter ones. He's 12 and those are little wood eggs for the Annalee. They start at 5.30 Eastern Standard Time. There is no registration. You just say sold, but you have to tell me which item because there's a delay of anywhere from 15 seconds to a minute in some cases with the Facebook. So I might be on to second or third item and I don't know what you're talking about. So, and we also, because I'm using just one device to look at the comments, we do rely heavily on my 
viewers and everybody's been very good about saying, no, no, that one had it first and it goes by majority rules. So if you do pop on to our Facebook Live, I, I'll tell you, you know, we ship most of the things from that. And all I ask you, if you've never bought from us before and you pop on there after the Facebook Live is over, just direct message me your zip code and, let, and just let me know oh, I'm the one who bought, you know, these things, which I put your name on it anyway, but just give me your zip code and then I can send you a PayPal invoice with the shipping on there. And to get an idea of how much shipping would be, I suggest going to the USPS website and putting in our zip code of 0782. Well, you go up to the top, it says calculate. So put in our zip code of 07821 and that will give you the shipping from, and then you put in, there it is, and then you put in your zip code and then put in a few different numbers to play with to see what it comes up with. We usually use priority. For some of the cases, if it's a dramatic difference, we have been doing the parcel post, uh, which we find for like the West in that, and we are able to do that on many of them. Not all of them, it depends on what the size of the package is, but that saves you quite a bit of money, the parcel post. This is beautiful. Well, oh, it's a print. I was gonna say, that's really, okay. Yeah, that's really nice. That's just 24, but it looks like an oil. It's like the colors are so vibrant and it looks so older. That's why, because it's a print. This is the Tanola Birds for 1120. I forget which YouTuber influencer I was watching the other day, and she folk loves those because they apparently go for very well on her eBay store. So keep in mind on that. Here you go. I got your new stove for you, Roper for 28. That's really cool. We got a dollhouse, some great pieces. We have uh, three or four vendors that tend to find dollhouse furniture and bring it in. So if you're still into that hobby of dollhouses, we have it come in and it goes right out pretty much. These are beautiful, they're cabbage rose. And it's 24 for the set of four goblets. So very pretty. I thought this was a really good deal. It's just $12, this is milk glass. Uh, I didn't have time to really turn it over and look for any markings. It is the great pattern. We can take that apart if you wanted that shipped. So that would be 32 for him. The whole Coca-Cola stuff. And I'm gonna go to the center. This looks like a hummingbird feeder. It is for just $8. So they'll be coming around again soon. I watched a really interesting documentary on hummingbirds. If you ever get a chance to watch that, I forget which streaming service it was on, but it was very informative, very interesting to learn about the hummingbird. So again, right now we're visiting with vendor Vintage Crush, and like I said, on their tags, you'll see their vendor code is in the upper left, and she is a 20% off, so 15 becomes just 12. This is a glass, what you, this is adorable, and I can't believe it's still here. It's, it's blown glass, it's glass in there, and it's, it's got a little bit of age to it. It's a feeder for people, so it's a little bird head, and I don't know where the tag, oh, the tag must be on the inside of it. So if anybody has any interest in this, I just thought this thing was hysterical, but with one hand, I'm not really able to open this. This is a fantastic lamp, though I'm not so sure about the shade on it, but just look at this lamp, it's a gorgeous MCM lamp, and that is just $28 for that, so. You may have another lamp that that shade would fit on, kind of do a swap thing. I mean, for $28, you're getting a gorgeous amber glass lamp with this fun shade that I'm sure by itself is just $28. And there's always a good selection of afghans and linens, a little bit of clothing, some vintage clothing comes in from time to time. We don't have a booth dedicated to that, but they do bring in pieces. That's a good deal on that frame. Am I seeing that right? Just $8 on that. And she probably has the measurements on it. It does have that fabric trim in there it's a very nice one super easy to paint so this was vintage crush this is bronx man cave across the way we are passing on second thought i feel like i'm on an airplane and we are now flying over okay now we're coming up on andover junction she is vendor number one and she's vendor number one for a reason because she has been with gray barn the longest she was the original at slackyville she was also the manager of the shop there any of that white powder you see is still from the absorption of the oil spill that we had. Um, we just have to sweep that batch up. Got it pretty much under control, so. Still just a lingering smell, but not like it was. And it's, it's more of like the normal when the furnace kicks on smell. So I don't think there's anything 
not like it was. I walked in tonight and it was really pretty good. She has a lot of prints and again, she is 20% off. So 55 becomes 44. They're nicely framed. This is um, print four of 50 that's been signed. And this is the Broadway Limited. And that's 85 and then 20% off. Here's a nice white lantern for 24. Good deal on this large golden lager mirror. That is just 36. And then she has these really cute little anthropomorphic cups and they are $8 each. So, and if you don't already follow us on Facebook and Inst or Instagram, um, you might want to because we also post daily uh, pictures of individual items, vignettes. I'll do a booth shot, which if you're on your phone, uh, you can actually, you know, make it zoom out so you can see closer. And I have a lot of people buying things that way. Because sometimes I'll just take a picture of like this shelf. And then somebody will say, well, how much is that white bunny on the left? And I get that back to them and they can buy that. So depending on what the day is like, because it's usually just Don and I in here and I am the social media person. So I try to get as much done as I can. And I wish I could get every item in this shop up online, but it just doesn't work that way. I thought this was fantastic. It's just $12. Very unusual for a milk glass taper candle holder. And it has the hobnail chimney. So very cool decorative piece. Happy anniversary. And that's 29 and then 20% off. So she will be bringing in more of that shelf is just because, like I said, with that oil leak that we had the two weeks ago, uh, this was one of the bookcases that got destroyed. We just finally swapped one back over here for it. So there's a lot of crystal in here too. We, uh, we, any of the blow molds, you might have seen that we had an Easter Bunny blow mold the other day. He is still here, still available. He was posted on Instagram and Facebook. So if he is something that you're interested in, that is there. We tell our vendors blow molds no matter what the season, no matter what they're, bring them in because we have people collecting them all year. Now we visited with Pick and Wildflowers last week. I just wanted to bring to your, your attention a really good project piece, structurally sound. It is a great piece to do. Look at this. This table is just $15.20. There's your measurements. You can leave it as is, or it's a perfect project piece. If you want to paint it, distress it, give it some character. Um, I do recommend on the top, if you're going to be doing any kind of um, painting on it and you want to adhere anything to it, it does need a light sanding. It has a very smooth finish on the top. So I do recommend that you might have to do a little bit of work on there. Now we are with our Belmont Farmhouse. She is the last vendor we will visit with tonight. And she's also 30% off. She is vendor code 56. So a lot of these lights do work that you see hanging. We just don't have them all electrified and hanging. So I just want you to see the sides of her booth. And then we're going to head on in. Uh, you'll see some bare spots. We did have a nice busy weekend. So there's a lot of things that went out. A cool little plant stand here and that is $21 this is a nice little wood tray $4.90 now as is our vent, this vendor she'll tent like see that chip there this isn't like natural vintage the items are used in vintage so they do show normal wear and tear so you always have to well have people come up a lot of times with the item and say what's the as is on this I, I don't see it and it's just normal crazing or whatever um, Vendor, uh, Belmont Farmhouse pretends to be very particular. So, there's this nice little rack here for just 14. You see that up there. There were those lamps they sold. So, we got a very good deal on that. She has a lot of books. The prices are right inside the cover with those post it notes. Oh, I got to put that one back. I see that was pulled out and not put back. And again, this is Belmont Farmhouse, and she is 30% off. All the furniture in the center of her booth, all these pieces here, and then on the back wall, starting with that half table over to the little stools and that, those pieces are all for sale. The shelving on the perimeter here and over on the wall, the space over here, those shelves are not for sale, but everything else furniture wise is for sale. So again, this is Belmont Farmhouse. You are to take 30% off. Cute little chair, wow, just $2.80 for the wood chair. Very cute. So 70 becomes 49. I showed these, I featured these the other day because I thought 
at 420 these are a fantastic price that's 420 each i love this color they're in really remarkable good shape there's this there's three of them and they're just 420 each now here's a contemporary piece to make that's made to look old and that's just 14 monogrammed vase here and that's 14 nice serving platter that's great for the spring beautiful springy serving platter made in japan and that's just 1750 and then this is the cronin blue tulip that was a i believe it was a and p that gave those away so this is each little set is just 420 and they do have the lids on the little soups so that's a really nice little deal it's got a lot of great serving pieces like I said, you're going to see a lot of blank spaces. Uh, she usually comes in on Wednesday to stock up, so we do expect to see her. So she does indicate new, so $17.50 so on that. So we do try to make sure that anything that's repro or newer, you know, people have an idea of what the age are. We do ask that they put that down. These are really cool. There's two of these, and they are, she's reduced them just recently to $10.50 each. So it's these candle holders are totally primitive with these hooks on the end, sharp hook. So those are really cool in a vignette hanging with or without the candle in it. We did have more of these. One of the other vendors has a few. They've been selling the yellowware molds. It's another one of those things that we have a bunch of and all of a sudden they're all gone and then somebody comes in looking for them and oh, don't have many more. Periodic table of elements, perfect for a child's room, college dorm room keep learning while you have some artwork up additional benefit right 840 on that beautiful piece of amber glass some great old pictures and they're framed and again this booth is Belmont farmhouse and she is 30 percent off that's pretty cool 1974 so 16 and then 30 percent off for of that when you're coming up on 1976 the bicentennial a lot of things were revolutionary inspired Washington Step back this table here another great project piece this one is just $21 so we have two tables that are and this one's higher we don't have the measurements on this one it does need a little shoring up a little bit of glue wouldn't hurt that one but it's still another wonderful project piece if I was still painting furniture I would grab those two they're perfect for painting can't quite see that so 30 wow that just becomes 21 Look at that fancy frame. Even if you don't like the still life, which is really pretty cool. And there's our signature. That is a fantastic frame at just $21. Some pretty wall pockets. There's a couple of them. And you always have to look underneath things as well. Our vendors make the best of all the space that they have. Oh my goodness. So this was 75. She wants this out of here. She has now marked this down to 20 and it's not firm so that's going to be just $14 for this standing yarn stand which I'm sure if you have a shop or do any kind of shows you might find some other use for this I am seeing if maybe you can get some more dowels attached to this or hang things over it what a cool jewelry display this would be or or scarves or something that's a really great deal on that just $21 on that Fifty becomes 105 25 becomes 1750 and again, these lights just need some wiring. Beautiful. That's 35. You see, it just has to be attached into your... Don knows how to do that. I don't. Oh, that's really nice. It's just $14. Can't quite see everything on it, though. This is an excellent mirror. I mean, it's got the old glass in there, so it does show somewhere. So that's 45 and then 30% off. It still has the tassel medallion with it and the old fashion prints. And then this I featured the other day. California modernist. So this is uh, 1969 girl from Spain. It's a very haunting picture. I just love the layers, the amount of, te look, the texture of this paint, it's just gorgeous. And that is 30% off of that 125. So again, if I go past things that you want more information on, I zip by it too fast or whatever, please, just let me know and I will get you that information. That's a good deal on this, 14. The as is, is just some rust on it. So nice planter, we're coming up on that season. Another cute 
cute little glass table for your porch. 35 and then that. I mean, you could sand paint, uh, spray paint that if you wanted to. You don't have to. There's always some great enamel wear in here. I saw the pan like this the other day. People like these for just hanging like up 630 and using them in the back of their vignettes. Now look at this cute little basket thingy. That's 1750. It's a half basket. It's got some age to it. It's a nice planter. Very nice. Great milk glass. This she just brought in. This is a penny art. And there's some old ones in there, including a 1943, I believe that is, when they didn't use the copper during the war. So there's some really old pennies on here. It's just so unusual. That piece of, and the rest of it is wood. This nice long print is just $14. I mean, the frame alone is worth that. little vanity tray. That's funky. 14. It's gold. It's not a mirror. It's it's like a gold foil finish on that one. This is a nice, what is this, Aura Force? Yep. Wow. She wants that gone. It's got a small chip on it. $7. Oh yeah, I feel it. There's one here too. It's got a few chips on it. it still catches the light so pretty. That's a cute little set. $7 for that little vintage green set. It's picking up more blue on my camera, but it's, it's actually more green. That's a nice little Painted plate there for $4.90. Got a lot of great cake stands in here. I, lo I know people love to get them in different sizes and stack them and use them as for different displays, even for your food displays. $14 for the Van Gogh print. That's a fun one. It's got some fabric, not a whole lot left, but there, there was more. She's constantly bringing in great vintage fabric. Her kitchen accessories are over here. Some more painted plates, some great glasses and milk bottles. I do believe this corner shelf is for sale. It is, and she's gone down from 24 to 20. Now it's just 16 for the corner shelf, and that you're going to take that 30% off. What a pretty cup that is. 350 for the little girl. It's a little Victorian cup. I don't see any problems with it. That pretty little violet cup. A nice little display piece that one is. Very sweet. A great little sifter here with the green handle. This is like 1920s, 30s. She's reduced that. That's just 630. And it's got the wood knob here. We've got some tennis rackets back here. I can't really get to the pricing on those too easily. But if you're interested in those, we're getting to that time of the year to decorate. I'm sure they're not that much. Part of a phonograph here, which I, we had. We, there were two. She sold one. I don't know what the, they were using it for some sort of display. We did not get to see that. It's a shame this does not have the piece that went in it. I can just imagine what a beautiful piece of glass sat in there. And look at this. I'm going to say Black Forest is what I think it is. It's as is. It has some, some wear and tear and missing to it. But uh, she had this for a long time in her own home. And just brought it in recently. It's just a magnificent piece of carved wood here. And just the details. Just got a lot of age to it. And that's going to be 30% ah, off that 65 I'm always glad when I hear it's metal that I've accidentally hit. So, and this shelf is for sale as well. And a little rolling, roly poly little bin here. There we go. Let's, I'm sorry. I'm kind of looking with my eyes and not with the camera. Sorry about that. 1750's got like lots of chippy paint. If you want to keep that chippy paint on there, I do suggest that you do a top coat on it. And top coat doesn't even have to be, you can do a water based. My, um, the Mod Podge works fantastic. I did an outdoor sign for somebody several years ago and the sign still looks amazing and all I did was seal it with some Mod Podge and it still looks great. Very cool little stool here. Tin for 28. What's the price on this stool? That's a cute little tote here as well. And that's been reduced as well. So that'll be 30% off of that 14. Oh, there's the tag. And if I step back, so the stool is 45 and then 30% off. Look at that great paint on there, that old paint. Very nice. All right, so this was Belmont Farmhouse. And we visited with Andover Junction, which we're going to pass by again. This is the Looking Glass. We have Redreamable, Burning Sensations up here on the left. And then over here, this is our Andover Junction where those two bookcases, the white bookcases, the tan one there, and then that back wall and that little corner is Andover Junction. 
And over on the other side, we visited with Vintage Crush. And in our front room, we visited with all four vendors in their extra bookcases and their lock shelves. So again, Belmont Farmhouse is 30%, not a 20% off. And again, if you want to reach out to us, you can call us at 973-786-5555. Feel free to email us at graybarn at graybarnantiques.com, gray with the E. We are on Facebook at Gray Barn Antiques. We're on Instagram at Gray Period Barn. Please be sure to subscribe to our channel so you're alerted to all new content. And again, tomorrow night at 5.30 Eastern Standard Time is our weekly Facebook Live. I hope you have a wonderful evening. Thank you for visiting with Gray Barn.